Lisa Pinkerton joins us this uh, morning to talk about a whole lot of fun that's coming up on the weekend, October, right around the corner, and that means the Roland Pumpkin Fair. Good morning. Uh, tell us a little bit about the Pumpkin Fair. Oh, October 1st, first Saturday of October every year, and we're finally back after a couple of years off. We were just able to have the, um, the way off with just the growers the last couple of years, but we've got full day of activities. Everything's free except for what you eat, basically, thanks to all our sponsors. So one of the, oh, that's amazing. One of the things that I need to ask about, like with the pandemic and, and you guys still having the way offs, was there more of a focus for the people growing the pumpkins? Like, did they have more time to kind of sit there and deal with making these pumpkins so huge? No, they're pretty hardcore every year, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of uh, friendly smack talk going on the day of, too. So <laughs> That's amazing. Now, with the Pumpkin Fair, um, obviously it's a, a big thing for Roland, right? It brings a lot of people into the community. Uh, what does it mean for the community to be able to have this back again? Well, we were supposed to be celebrating our 30th, and we had to postpone the 30th for two years. So uh, having it back is is huge. So, It'll be a lot of fun. What are some of the things that families can do this weekend? Uh, well, there's the big way off at 1030 that a lot of people like to come and watch. And we have a big craft show. We have free kids activities all afternoon. There's a choo-choo train, bouncing houses, uh, face painting, pumpkin patch tea room. You can try pumpkin desserts. And then we have uh, free entertainment all afternoon featuring Al Simmons at 1 o'clock. We're really excited to have him out this year. That is going to be a lot of fun. Everything kicks off uh, first thing in the morning. The Curling Club puts on a pancake breakfast as a fundraiser so and this year we're actually having a giant pumpkin drop at 2 30 as a new event we're uh, revamping our old tennis court park area so we're having a 50 50 raffle and we are going to drop a giant pumpkin onto the old courts from a crane oh my goodness that <laughs> sounds like it's going to be a mess to clean up but it'll also be a lot of fun too yeah that's what it's all about rolling pumpkin fair it's coming up this weekend october the first lisa thanks for doing this thanks